I am a modern, progressive woman in this country, and I am proud that this country is my home. As a woman who believes passion and inequality, in choice, and individuals' right to determine their own destiny. Right. As a woman elected to be the Member of Parliament for South Cambridge in the 21st century, who stood yesterday to support the Member for Waltham Stowe's request for this debate, because she is standing up for all the women in the UK, but mostly because I have been there, I'm making it my business. Yeah. The Irish referendum results spoke volumes about how people in Southern Ireland felt. They wanted change and they voted for it decisively. How can it be that Northern Ireland will soon be the only part of Great Britain and Ireland where terminations are to all intents and purposes outlawed? Yeah. I was ill when I made the incredibly hard decision to have a termination. I was having seizures every day. I wasn't even able to control my own body, let alone care for a new life. So, Mr Speaker, are you seriously telling me that in a civilised world, rape, incest or a foetus that is so sadly deformed that it could never live are not sufficient grounds for a woman to have the power to decide for herself yeah. that she shouldn't make that decision? No, enough. Very suddenly and unexpectedly, we have a window of opportunity before us. Whether you feel that window has opened as a consequence of no functioning devolved administration in Northern Ireland or because a neighbouring referendum was so close and so relevant as to be impossible to ignore, or simply because you feel the glaring light of equality and human rights illuminating the women of Northern Ireland, this has become their moment and they will have my unequivocal support.